Hello everyone and welcome. We have a box unboxing. Isn't that right, Shakes? Box? Mm-hmm. Can I go in the box? No, you, you cannot go in the box. She so we have a whole bunch of things um, for the store. Oh. So let's see exactly what we've got here. I'm going to come over this side of the camera. Um, so this is a Yu-Gi-Oh unboxing thing. So first of all, we have the Yu-Gi-Oh flip coin. Oh, look at Sheeps. Heads or tails? Um, do we have... Uh, can someone go get me sellers? <laughs> I just realised that this will not open easily enough. Uh, she threw over there behind the tent. There we go. Okay, you know what? We will come back to the usual flip coin. Um, boss man, what one do you think? This one, this one, or this one? Middle. The middle one? Oh, sheeps. Look at this. Limited to only 9,995 worldwide. Oh, These are individually numbered embossed Millennium mm. Stone displays. Oh. oh. Ooh. Isn't that awesome? That looks really cool. Yeah. It's, uh, it's the actual Millennium Stone, you know, that... Um, uh, Millennium Cup. Yes. Which was supposed to be the sarcophagus to the Pharaoh, I think. To Athen. And all of his Millennium items were all... Pretty sure it's a bit sealed. Uh, hmm, it Maybe. seems to be. Yep. Do you take a look at it? It doesn't look like there's anything on it. Oh, sheeps, you open it? Give that a good shake. Don't take it off camera to open it. No, I'm trying. Don't camera. I'm trying. Yeah, let me. Think. <laughs> think, sheeps. Think. It, there's no seal on it. I know that for sure. No, no, it's okay. It just opens. Oh, it's just a bit tight. Yep, it's just the first time that it's ever been opened. It's Mike's favourite. Oh, it actually looks pretty cool. So, let's take a look. So, the entire box is just like this, limited edition. But let's see what it looks like on the actual inside. Ooh. Oh, it says Yu Gi Oh on the inside. Um, so, this is number 4850. Oh, good note. And there is our little point, and there's our little display as well. There's another one. I'm just stuck in our mind trying to get that. Very good, sheeps. No, literally, it's stuck in there. Try that. Such a weird sheeps. There we go. You've got nails. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's, that's the only explanation. Um, so presumably this just clips together like so. Oh, it's got a bit of weight in it. Yeah, it's kind of cool. It's very, very nice. You can see all the Millennium items. Go on, Sheeps. Name all the Millennium items. Uh, so, Millennium Puzzle. The Millennium Puzzle is there. The scale. That is the scales. That is the... Um, this two. The eye. The Millennium Eye is in the middle. Oh, it's the middle one. Yep, it's okay. in the forehead. Um, Three. Ring. Yep, the ring is four. Rods. The rods is five. Key. The ank is six. Uh, let's see here. Oh, it's got the most important one of all. It's not the most important, it's barely important. Uh, don't say that. The ne oh, the, the necklace. The, the necklace, eh? Yep, which should be around the neck. Uh, no, there. It's, it's up there. Oh, okay. That's what I was ah. looking for. Ah, yeah, but they've got the most important one. The Interesting. Millennium Mani's a bug. <laughs> the Millennium Mani are a bug. <laughs> what, what, what about the Millennium Tablet? <laughs> yeah, the Millennium Tablet? That's not a thing. There we go. Ooh. Actually, it actually sits perfectly. It's almost like it's got a little indent on like it. Like it just clicks on? Yeah. That's fairly cool. Very nice. I think that's pretty awesome, Characters. actually. Oh, yes. We'll come to this. And a moment, um, I'm sure that everyone will all be excited to see that. I like so. carrots. And also, this is from Fan Attack um, for people at home no, wanting to know. So, this is a official Yu Gi Oh game flip coin. So, oh, this is also Fan Attack. Oh, Maybe it's not are official. They all Fan Attack? That's amazing. Well, now I'm not so sure. <laughs> I thought it was official, um, but I thought the Fan Attack stuff they're was. They're distributed unofficial. by Fan Attack. Yeah. So I assume they are official. I don't think they are. Because it would probably say official Konami or something like that. I'm really unsure. But um, let's cut this open anyway and see what the official uh, Yu-Gi-Oh flip they, coin is. They did surgery on a coin. There we go. And, Just um, caught that bit goodly. This should open like so. I think you might need to give it a bit of a cut again, or... Possibly. Don't cut your fingers. They've tried to, um... Man, that's, uh... Ooh. 
Pretty stuff. But there we go. Crap, didn't sound very reassuring. Well, it's okay. It's only the, the little plastic bit around it. As long as we get the coin, then we're fine. You know what, I'm just going to pull this out here. Oh, okay. So Ooh. it actually comes in its own little plastic container. So you can see that this is a separate plastic container. And we've got this little one here. So they've tried to make it like, um, you know, the official Coin. uh, coins you know, that you get from the Royal Mint. I've got quite a few of these myself. Um, probably many people have seen my um, five pound coins. Thank you, Shoops. Thank you. So... It's a bit of a refusal, Reba. It's um, certainly a little bit tight, there but go. there we go. So, so there is head the... Tails? Well, uh, I assume ah, that's heads. Ah, okay. <laughs> right, Grand Cat, heads or tails? Um, Aye. I will say heads. Sheeps. Okay, I'll go tails. Okay. Go mm, right. Okay, you can, you're going to catch? I'll catch. Up. Okay, you catch. Yeah. Okay, go. 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 Oh, heads. Yeah. See? I'm so good. <laughs> um, so I think we'll keep this little thing, because I think that's a pretty cool little... It's a good wee holder for it. Yeah. I'm, I don't know if it could probably go in this as well. No, I think, I think the Millennium uh, one is a bit significantly uh, okay. larger. I see. But... Yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, I'm, I kind of like these so far, the little stuff that we've got. Uh, the next one is the limited edition coin. Oh, also limited to 9,985. That Falcon company. Yes, embossed on both sides of the antique silver edition. And, oh, look, Ooh, we yes. have the Seto Kaiba coin. Ooh, yeah, take very, a look at it. Ooh, very nice. They got the Japanese on that as well. Oh, yes. So, let's... Oh, right. Ah, it's got little bits yeah. here yeah. that you just need to open up, um, and then you and then this should just pull apart. Open up, open up. There we go. Yeah. And then the uh, coin just look. comes out. And also, I think this is in the same kind of plastic little thing that this is. Uh, this coin feels a little bit thicker, but um, let's see what it looks like. So there we go. There is the official Seto Kaiba coin. Um, I don't know what this says on the side here. I want message. I think it might say Yu-Gi-Oh. Maybe. Unless it just says let's do it, but oh, I doubt that. Very nice. Heads or tails? Yeah, no, I think, I think it's Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> you want to catch it again, Chiefs? Yeah, okay. Heads okay. or tails? Uh, I am going to say tails this time. So, go. Oh, heads. You naughty sheep's eyes, or are you turning that? <laughs> well, that's how you do it, right? Nail Kaiba okay, well, one. Oh, no. Ooh. Oh, you do. Oh, well, this is also limited to 9,995 worldwide. Individually numbered. Individually numbered. Embossed. Wait, was that last one individually numbered? Um, no. No, okay, it doesn't actually say individually numbered. No, it does say individually numbered. Wait, so what's this number? Um, no, I mean, I think it means like... Oh, there it is. This is number 867. Oh, Whoa. what number was that? Uh, let's see here. The Game Plot Coin one, I don't think is limited to... I don't think that one's limited. Oh, so... Mm, doesn't No, this one doesn't say. So no. presumably that one is oh, mass produced. There's your coin. But it's not our mythical number that we're going to buy. metal card display stand plate. Ooh. It is indeed. And I thought I would get the best card of all of them. Ah, it better be muted. Oh. <laughs> what does it do? It's the pot of sheebs. What does it do? Well, it allows you to drink drinks when you're in Casey. It allows you to draw two sheeps. It allows you to draw two sheeps. All right, well, you get a piece of paper and a crayon and you can draw two sheeps. <laughs> 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 that, that card gives you permission to do that, should you so want to. It's a bit of paper yeah. Done. Mm, there. I believe that artwork actually came from Milo, who is our yeah. youngest duelist. So, um, I, first of all, the box is fantastic because it's the all set to look is really like good. Pot the pot of Okay, before we open this up, does anyone want to take a guess at the number? 1701. 1701, that would be amazing. <laughs> that, is, uh, that is from Star Trek. Uh, uh, Sheeps, what do you think? I don't know. I am going to say 9000. Uh, what are the options? Uh, anywhere between uh, 0 Perfect. and 9,995. 8,000. 8,000? Mm -hmm. Okay. Everyone else? Waiting for Alex. Any number between 1 and 
Almost you, 10, for 000. some reason, you could also say one. Yeah, <laughs> if you wanted. No, uh, 5,600. 5,600? Oh, big dog? 2,700. Two. Oh, oh, very nice. And Baron? 420. <laughs> 420. <laughs> nice. So That's let's right. see. We got 5,966. Um, was anyone even close to that? Uh, Alex said 5,000 something. I think I said 5,600. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty close. Oh, damn. Yeah, he was I also pretty close to that. I think this is awesome. Um, mm-hmm. can, can someone give me a Yu-Gi-Oh card just to compare the size of this uh, oh, to? Oh, cool. Let me get my sheets. The sheets. It's my sheets card, can you? Yeah, sure. Why not? So, there we go. Uh, turn around. So that is the scale. So it's obviously a bit smaller than your regular Yu-Yu card, but I mean, it's not actually meant to be a card. It's just meant to be a representation of the card. But look at that big, happy, glorious grin. How can you not be satisfied? How can you not draw two cards after seeing that? <laughs> yeah, I mean, how cards. how could you absolutely not? How could, wait, so um, can I, before can I that we one? go on to the last one, uh, we're going to make the last one its own separate video. Uh, let's take a quick look at all the things. So we got the Seto Kaiba coin, we got the Yu-Gi-Oh flip coin, and... They're all flip coins. <laughs> they're all flip coins. And of course we got the Millennium Stone. Um, so these, yeah. yeah, these two are exactly the same. So these are just displays, so... To display the pot? Oh, greed. In the bottom greed. I nearly got you demonetized there. <laughs> you better not, sheeps. You naughty, naughty sheeps. Yeah, you need to oh. back some money. No? So, there we go. Um, so, in the next video, we're going to be looking at this big, carrot. glorious thing. Yes, it is Exodia the Forbidden One, 24 carat gold plated Ignot uh, set. Ignot? Uh, ingot. <laughs> What's that? Um, it's gold. Gold sheeps. Yes. So, uh, I'm get, like, grade four braces now. No, oh, Jeeves. Yeah, there's two of them. Okay, so that is going to be it for this video, folks. I hope you all enjoyed, and if you did, please give us a like, share, and subscribe. And if you are subscribed, make sure you click that notification icon so you can see the glorious golden Exodia when we review that in the next video. Goodbye, everybody.